everybody, this is Luke Walter here at Piano Market Plus in Elkhart in Mishawaka, Indiana. Today we're going to be going over this Yamaha B3 Polish Ebony. We're going to be going over the damper and how that works, the right pedal when you're sitting at the piano. So we're going to start down here with the pedal itself. So you're going to see, as soon as you press the pedal right here, you're going to see this bar in the back, which we call the trap work, is moving. It has its first wing nut, which is adjustable to be able to adjust what needs to be done, so that way you don't have lost motion or the pedal's pressing too early. There's multiple ways that can go. It goes over to a bar in the back and then up to the back of the action. There's a little lever in the back of the action. You're not going to be able to see it with the camera, but it presses a bar into all of those dampers to all set them all at the same time. We call this damper timing. So if you have an older piano, you might see this where the dampers, some might move earlier than the others. The whole thing with the new piano is the, when we do the regulation, we want all those wires to be bent perfectly. So when we press that pedal, if you see up here, they're all going to move at the same time. They're not going to be staggered. They're not going to be one barely touching. They're all moving at the same time. And that happens all the way across in the upright right pedal. And even the grands, but it's a little bit different. An upright is a forced pedal because it doesn't have the gravity like a grand would where the dampers fall down and it's a gravity fed action. Uprights are a force fed action, force fed damper system. And then what that does, the right pedal, so if you're playing a song and you want to play a chord, it lifts all the strings so that way it sustains those strings and you can keep going. And then when you normally play, it's just going to move the dampers of what you're playing and it's going to cut those off. And that's what a right pedal does. And if you have any more questions, we're going to be going over more videos of what other things do in the pianos, like the middle pedal and the left pedal in different pianos. There are different functions of these pedals mattering on the brand and style of piano. If you have any questions, feel free to form submission or just put a comment on this video. We'd love to answer. Thank you.